Greetings to you all. Welcome to class 6 English Bridge Course Workbook Worksheet 3 Unit 1 Supplementary Reading Auli Dear children, today we are going to do the worksheet in the Bridge Course. Alright? Already have studied the lesson in detail. Bilingual explanation, book back exercise, all other activities, guided reading, all of this is a worksheet. In fact, you should do it alone. If you are doing it, you will have a guidance, a help, an assistant. That is why you have to copy it. You will 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 have to copy it. You write on your own. You will have to listen to it. You will have to copy it. You will have to copy it. You will have to copy it. Good children. Very good. You will have to copy it. You will have to copy it. All right. Coming to Roman number one. Read the table and answer the questions given below. Give a table. Give a table. Yes. Average lifespan of birds in years. One average lifespan. One bird. How many years ago? That's one box. For example, crow. How many years ago? 15 to 20 years. One crow. How many years ago? 15 years ago. 20 years ago. What about parrot? 25 to 30 years. 25 years ago, 30 years ago. Owl. Owl, you know, that's it. 9 years to 10 years. 10 years ago, 10 years ago. Peacock. That's 15 to 20 years. Okay? So, this is the lifespan of the birds. Did you know? Fine children. So, based on this tabular column, we have to answer the questions. Which bird has the least lifespan in the given table? So, in the given table, in the bird, it is a small lifespan. A small bird. Which one tell me? See, you have 15 to 20, 25 to 30, 9 to 10, 15 to 20. So, 9 to 10, that is not a small bird. That is not a small bird. So, a small bird is the least lifespan, 9 to 10 years. So, owl has the least lifespan in the given table. Fine children, always write in full sentence. If you are slow, you will be able to do late bloomers when you will be able to do 9 to 10. Otherwise, always write full sentence. Next question, write the name of the birds that have the similar lifespan. So, in the box, two birds, two birds have the same lifespan. அதே மாதிரி இருக்கிறேன். அது யாரில்லாக்கும்? So, a peacock. Peacock, 15 to 20 years. Same 15 to 20 years இருக்கிறுக்குது? Crow. Crow is also having 15 to 20 years. Crow and peacock have the similar lifespan. அது என்னது? 15 to 20 years. Fine children? Okay, moving on to second Roman number. Choose the correct synonym for the underlined word based on the context given. Piles house was home to all kinds of creatures, mainly abandoned animals. Already you have studied in the book. Okay. Piles house. Yaar kakko? Veda arukkudhe? Abandoned animals. So, ipo answer vandhe. Abandoned oda synonym. Abandoned oda purul. Same word edhe. Trustworthy, forsaken, plentiful, extinct. So, which is the right answer? Abandoned. Adhaadhe purakkanikke patta. Adhe thallip. Which, that is right, that is forsaken. Fourth one. When Pyle's mother opened the carton, there was the smallest of owlets sitting in one corner. Okay. Pyle's mother and the carton, and the petty turn the back and forth, a little owlet, owlet baby in the corner of the cage. Mother opened the carton. There was the smallest of owlets sitting in one corner. Right cage. In fact, and the bird Carton is not a corner, but here the carton option is not there. So, you can write KH. Third question, children. Fifth one. Develop the hints into three meaningful sentences. You are given some words, hints developing. So, you have to develop into meaningful sentences. You can write on your own. So, you need not just like that copy it. The words are owls, hunters, Eat rats, snakes and frogs, pile sows, all vegetarian. So shall we write? Your own, we will put it in the class. 
Owls are hunter birds. They eat rats, snakes, frogs. In Pyle's house, all are vegetarians. Even the dogs. Pyle's mother was totally anti-meat. But now, an owl have come to stay. She had to get over her dislike for meat. That is why you have to eat meat. You have to eat meat in the pile. You have to eat meat in the pile. But, you have to eat meat in the pile. Fine. Fourth Roman number, sixth. Write any four words associated with owl. Okay, owl is a four words. So, we already have to learn. Owl is one of the hunters. Next one. Non-vegetarians. Owls are night birds. We can otherwise call it as nocturnal animals. They are wise, very intelligent. Okay, we even call as a parliament of owls for a group of owls. Okay, that's why you can't do anything else. Fine children. Okay, fifth one. Seventh question. Select the words from the word bank and write them in the suitable column. In the column, you have some words. Rabbit, hatchling, owlet, bunny, cow, owl, turtle, calf. Okay. Now, you can see this. One is the adult, one is the baby. Okay. So, yeah. For example, rabbit, hatchling, owlet, bunny, cow, owl, turtle, turtle, calf. So, one is the big and one is small. Okay. Mother, baby. Clear. Okay. So, this mother is a rabbit. Who is a rabbit? Who is a mother? Who is a baby? Mother. Hatchling is a baby. So, hatchling is a baby. Owlet. Owlet is a baby. 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 Bunny. That is also a baby. Cow. That is a mother. Owl. Mother. Turtle. Mother. Calf. Baby. Fine children? Okay. Sixth Roman number, eighth question. Read the description about a parrot given below. Similarly, describe any bird you like. Okay. You have to describe the parrot pathi kuduthirukkuraanga. You have to describe any other bird. First parrot pathi padikilama. Parrot is a beautiful talking bird. There are many varieties of parrots in the world. The green parrot has green feathers and red beak. Parrot eats grains, fruits, leaves, nuts, etc. The parrot is found in warm countries. Alright, this is the parrot. What is the parrot? 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 You can write on any other bird children. So, I will write on the parrot. Okay. Peacock is a beautiful dancing bird. There are many varieties of peacocks in the world. They have different colors. They dance well during rainy season. They can fly to some extent. Peacock eats grains, fruits, nuts, etc. Peacock is our national bird. I like peacock very much. Okay? Fine. You can see the bird as well. This is just a sample. Next one. Solve the following riddles. I am usually black and white. But I am not a polar bear. I am black and white. But I am not a polar bear. Who is it? Zebra. Okay? Fine. Second one. I have wings. But I cannot fly. Penguin. I am wings. But I am not a polar bear. Who is it? Penguin. It is cold and icy where I live. Who am I? Cold and icy. Who is it? Who is it? Who is it? Penguin. Okay. Eighth Roman number. Tenth question. Look at the pictures and write a short story using the clues given. Farmer. Four oxen. Forest. Hungry lion. Hunt. Kill. Defeated. Separation. United. Fine children. That is one. தமிழில் சொல்லுனாக்கா, farmer, ஒரு விவேசாய் இருக்கிறாங்க, four oxen, four மாடு, okay, இருக்குது, forest, காடு, hungry lion, பசியான, ஒரு lion, hunt, கொலப்பனனும் இருக்குது, kill, defeated, தோத்து போகுது, அனா, separate அகும்புது, என்னாச்சே, 
reunited once upon a time there was a farmer munnor kaalathil or farmer irundanga he had four oxen avarku ethana per irundanga four oxen irundathu in the forest there lived one hungry lion it was searching for food it wanted to hunt some animal and eat and the hungry lion ku yariyadu saapidnonu aasai irukku it saw four oxen together so he could not go near so ana ang irukku four oxen seind irukranga naalu maadu seind irukanaala kitta poga mudiyala once the four oxen were separated in the four oxen enachu thani thaniya poiruchu then the lion could easily eat all the oxen thani thaniya pona apuruma one by one thani thaniya pudichu saapiduchu this story tells us that we must be united okay and we should not be divided unity is strength united we stand divided we fall we must be always united hope you all of you understood children so idu ungalku or guide only adukaga apdiye copy adikka kudadu you can write on your own then only you can improve understand all right thank you children i hope you might have listened the explanation videos book back exercise videos and guided reading and other activities fine children